Let me tell you about one of my great loves, Koei, if I'm pronouncing that right, are one of my favourite companies. The roots are in historic strategy games, you know, games like Romance of the Three Kingdoms and Kessen, games that are probably unappreciated by pricks like yous. Koei is a company that does everything right, gameplay, production, voice talent. Forgive me, I lost. This never happened before. Eh, uh, maybe no voice talent, actually. But Koei and the West certainly are often the master of the criminally ignored games, like the Fantastic Dynasty Tactics 1 and 2, both of them great, both of them quite savagely ignored. Of course, all is not lost in the West for Koei because there is the Dynasty Warriors games. She's like that, didn't you? I get a load of slashing and fighting rubbish. I'm not a fan of these games, to be honest, and it is not a thing to do with me being absolutely gash at them. But that's where Koei really gets Consylvania's respect, because they're a company that stick to their roots. They're no sellouts. They stick to their roots and they put out really, really hard games. Non-commercial, difficult games, like the recent G1 Jockey 4 that I played for weeks and never won one fucking race. Not one fucking race. But oh, get a room, man. Koei's greatest gift to the gamer. Possibly the greatest game on the PlayStation 2. Possibly the greatest game of last generation. Yes, that is how much I love this game. Words can barely express it. And why are we excited at Consylvania? Because there's a PSP version coming out. Probably just a port, but bring it on. Bring it on. I could play this game to the day I die. And I will die. I will die. We'll all die. But at least we'll have memories of this to remember when our brains are dead. And when our souls are passed on to the spirit beyond. And all the great Valkyries and warriors and horses are standing on guard asking us, the people not the horses, what our favourite games were. We will say, fucking get a room, man.